Welcome to my channel. Please like and subscribe. Thank you. Like one of the Asian priests, and his name is <laughs> okay. The name is Ugo Basi. Is it Ugo Basi? Yeah, Ugo Basi. Yeah, Ugo Basi. So Ugo Basi sounds more Nigerian and more. We, you know, we we are like to own everything, but then it's not Nigerian, but then it sounds like Igbo. So yeah, I'm going to show you the picture. You see. Of Bologna. Is it Bologna? I need to get the name right. This is the beautiful center of Bologna. And you are seeing at the background, it's really tiny, but then I'm going to show you the picture of, I don't know the name, I can't remember the name of what it's called. It's My really beautiful. Yeah. yeah, look what's up. Oh, I know. Yeah, like I can't even, I don't know how to express it. So it's really beautiful here. Yeah. You should put Bologna as part of a place to visit when you're coming to Italy just for like a tour or something. It's gonna watch it. You're gonna your mind is gonna be blown away. Because I am blown away right now. I'm actually having a nice time here, so I'm still gonna say that it's a place to visit like I've taken a million pictures and I've lost scans already so yeah you should come here and the thing is that they I'm gonna show you something like they show when it's summer they have like this center and then they show like movies or something more like an open cinema for everybody you can I think you can see the the chairs at the background I'm going to be going in and I think I can take pictures there so I'm still going to be sharing with you. We are still at the same time. We've not even moved an inch. What are these things? Abib, what are this? These are like heroes or something. I think what that's what they say. They are like what you're seeing and they are pictures. I'm going to like go closer for you to see. Like pictures of people like passports. Jeez. Yeah. Maybe yeah, Euro, Euro, oh, Italian Euro. Yeah, you heard what they said. They said they fought for the Liberty of Italy. So it's like two of them. You get the gist. So this is the name of the library. behind me so it has like an opposite one and then if you talk from this wall behind me the, the other person is going to hear from the other wall I don't know if you can see it so it's the other wall there and then if I speak from here you are going to hear and it, it sounds like there's a speaker or something but then they made us believe that it's an ancient thing and there's nothing like speaker so it's a secret of Italy 
or something of Bologna. So it's actually interesting. I don't know if you get my gist and that short. I'm gonna show you around. Hi, welcome. <laughs> Hello, Hi. guys. Welcome to our MTV crib. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm gonna be showing you around the house because this house is like very good. For the price, I didn't see it coming that it was gonna be this nice. So, yeah, I'm gonna show you around. Follow me. So, the first part is where are we taking it first? To the kitchen. The kitchen and the living room. Kitchen slice living room. Okay, okay. So these are random guests. Really? I'm also a random guest. <laughs> they are random guests. Please come and feature. These are my friends and I'm gonna be popular very soon. So I'm begging them to feature in my YouTube now and they are like for me. Very soon if I have like how many followers now. I'm telling you people. So yeah, this is like the kitchen. The the fact that it's all white makes it really nice and they, they actually did well with the, with the cleaning and all of it and Let's see your face. Say hi to the camera. <laughs> now I'm scared that my camera should not fall because if it should fall, you're not gonna see the end of this video. <laughs> yeah, so that's the. I love you, Italy. I love you, Italy. <laughs> yeah, this is the first room. It has a very comfortable bed. I'm going to really rate them well because. They really did well with the arrangement, with the clean. in the morning now actually i woke up late we woke up late because we were very tired from yesterday yesterday was a lot of things so today we are going we are on our way to san luca and it's like a really high one we are going to be climbing stairs and 
all of those things and it's going to be really really tiring. We've already climbed 22 steps. We'll be running, we'll be walking. <laughs> and I'm going to take you guys along, so let's go. Update, update. <coughs> I'm giving you the update for free. So, anyways, I'm not going to ask you to pay me. I just want to tell you to subscribe to my channel to get the full gist. So yeah, we are halfway. We're halfway already, and then we are almost there. We're almost. I'm going to show you how far we've gone. No, I can't even show you how far we've gone because you can't see it. But then, yeah, we we'll see how long. I see how long it is. It's very real. It's a journey. It's a journey. <laughs> okay. I've lost my breath. See this guy. This guy is he's lazy. He's a guy, but he's officially a lazy guy. See how he's breathing so fast. But then, for me, too, I'm, I'm so tired. And and we are like almost there. But it's a long journey. But then it's fun. It's something you should experience. Like you see. <laughs> it wasn't just me. Everybody's tired of this work. Now, Madame Ayanda, she's already, she's already all. No, she has so far sure, right? I'm, I've even lost breath. In fact, to compose the words I want to say, I don't know. But then, you see, it's not for the faint hearted. Don't come here. I don't know, I don't know. I hope what's up there is. Actually, like write something on the wall just to show when they came. See, somebody came here 2013, and someone came here 2006. <laughs> this work is not for the faint hearted, so they are they are trying to show you. We did it to the end. We didn't just go back. Seth, you just said, P. Susan came here. I think 1995. Should I write mine? I don't think so. But then let's go. They said we have almost gotten there, but it's me, I don't want to even believe them because <laughs> three more minutes. Three more minutes. Just three minutes. It's still very far. Just after after this stairs. You you heard what they said. They said just after the stairs. <laughs> but then after dying for the last <sighs> We are here finally. We are here. So we are not even here here <laughs> because it's like I'm going to show you the but then it's a it's a it's a long walk. We are one of the tallest places in Padua, uh, Bologna. Which is, you see, they have a really nice place here. It's actually a really beautiful view. So, what all the energy? But then, how many minutes does this walk take one person on the Wow. Let's say an hour for faint hearted like me. An hour. <laughs> Actually, this church is on the hill. Like everywhere in Italy is like cathedral, cathedral, cathedral. So this is what they actually put on the hill, the church on the hill. And I can't talk at all because this is a church. Normally in the church they just expect you to, to have a perfect decorum.
out our view of the the whole church and everything and where we like after climbing this is like and people just come here climb exercise and rest for a while before going back and like this is a it's a mighty one it's, i think i showed you the showed the inside and it's this is a it's really nice we had fun we had stress filled fun yeah but then we are going back now and i think going walking down is quite easier than going up obviously we all know that and it's raining outside and so let's go i think it's really nice to walk to do this walk when it's not so sunny that way you're not going to feel so tired so yeah let's go and um, i'm not going to do any vlogging throughout the journey any ways again so we'll see you dance this which will be about maybe in 30 minutes time so let's go I reach to yours. Oh my Kokwangale. Yeah guys we are here. Like we are back here. We made it down here. I did not break. I came I made it down here completely, like in one piece. So it was a nice experience and you should try it too. Thank you. Bye.